Good morning, good morning. I am so sorry I am late because I live between two phone time zones. The one phone tells me it's three minutes to nine and on the other phone the real time is two minutes past nine. Good morning and apologies, great apologies. Humble apologies for being late. <laughs> um, yeah, I am back in my mother's house because uh, the Joburg um, council, recess, holiday, whatever, whatever. Uh, so this is my mother's house. I am my mother's eldest daughter and I'm also the one that looks after my mother's interests. The house, the garden, everything. And this is also where I used to do the aftercare center. The aftercare is still happening. My friends uh, have taken over because I just couldn't let those babies go. It was really a concern for me that the children remain and the work still carries on. Let me just put something straight here because I think there's a few people that's a bit confused. I have been living in Johannesburg for 18 years. This would be the... During this pandemic, I had to come here because the house was standing still and so on. But I still had a place to stay in Johannesburg. So all I'm doing now is just going back. I come here every week because I have to. It's my master plek, man. I have to... I, is my home. This is where I grew up. This is where I went to primary school, high school, everything. So I will always come back home. This will always be home based. My, my post address play yesterday's dream of two It will always be like that. So good morning, everyone. I am so happy to be here to talk to you. Morning, Shao Bester. How are you doing, my brother? I wish all these names that I see one day, one day I meet you in person. So greetings from Gauteng. Uh, greetings on the UIM page. It is an honor and a privilege for me to be talking here. I never take opportunities like this for granted. It is important because we have to share vision. And always is no yammer. I will always be wearing the t-shirt when I come on this live. You know why? Because I'm proud of this brand. I'm proud of this party and I will stick with this party. You see, here's the thing. I am that type of person that I, I stay committed. Doesn't matter how difficult, how challenging uh, uh, a relationship is. I will only change or leave or start pulling back when I am being attacked. But let me tell you something, and there's a few people that, that's a bit confused. I just wanna, st I don't like confusion, man. I like people to be a little bit plus one over here. This party has only the members, the leadership, and everyone has only treated me with the utmost respect. They regard me, and, and it's not a question of, I will have a skinboard gedragen, because we are all workers, okay? But there's great reverence and respect, and I'm being considered. Before decisions are made, I know about it. I give my input. <laughs> and, and it makes me feel even more responsible, because then I'm thinking, I was part of that decision, so I have to think, Twice before I just say yes or no. But so far we are on a great, also a lekker wicked man. We do what we have to do. Why you thank you, like mooi and wit. I can try to make my hair still so to make, because you know what? As my, as my, as my hair is so, as I say, my daughter for me, like so, Patricia de Lolle, I thank you that you so. Don't like that. Anyway, so I needed to talk about. The five C's that we as a party have identified. Um, and it actually encompasses everything. Last week when I was in that circus, which it was definitely a circus, like a squad, because the Thursday, the, the, the Wednesday we were released because it was supposed to be closed, this, this whole council thing. And so I came through to Johannesburg because I had to do the live with Virginia on the stoop stories. And then boom, the 
Thursday late afternoon we get a notification we have to go back. As ek gevier het is dis dat dit gaan 'n sirkus wees, anders ek nie teruggegaan nie. But anyway. So why am I telling you that? Oh yeah. That's in that moment I realized how how huge the task is. And I also realized how important it is that the first Krikkelijk belangrijk. Dat ons die heel tijd, hallo Cheryl, dat ons die heel tijd een geschakel moet blij. Bij God. I realized it because for a few seconds I was out of, I wasn't in contact with God. I was totally, it was like a spirit had descended on that place. I wish you could be there and unfortunately we couldn't record. But the whole scene changed. It was, people became, it's like people became crazy. There was an aggressiveness. Uh, 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 a member called other members animals. And, and just, for, for a few seconds, I was like, what, how can one person call another person an animal? Because for me, it was about persons. It wasn't wit and brain, A and C and D R of P R of, no, it was People, it was humans for me. Because here's the thing. When all the layers are stripped away, when you strip away the fact that I am a woman, when you strip away the fact that I am brown in color, when you strip away the fact that I am part of the United Independent Movement, when you strip away all of those things, when you strip away the fact that I am a believer of Jesus Christ, when I lay in a coffin one day, you will only see a shell, a body. Because the spirit is intact, the soul is intact, linked, uh, protected by God. In the end, it is about that shell. Now, Last week, I see a lot, I saw, I see, I saw a lot of shells, doppa, that were carrying on like crazy people, for power, for power, for positions, for money, salaries, because here's the thing, since the ANC has taken, has not, not fairly, not legally, they have taken over like vultures. Obviously, the people that were in coalition with the DA, the positions is now for honor. Mensa wat MMCs was and Watson C's was and all the crumb titles. I am still not used to be called Councillor Abdul. That is for my sometimes reagir at me is because I I'm not used to that because those things don't matter to me. Um. So it is changing because the ANC will now put their people in and a uh, lot coalition, coalition partners gaan out, MMCs. Yes. I'm actually glad because, um, yeah, I was sitting, the position where I was sitting was forcing me to sit amongst people where I didn't want to sit. So I, I hope they change it, the, the, the seating and that they achter gaan sit, daar ver, because, yo, mm -mm. So I'm going to see that my ex sweat now, this is still there, I don't even know me. That's the thing, I don't know how fast it is. So, yeah. And while I was sitting there, there was a mother. Someone gave her my number. And she said, Fatima, um, I need your help. My daughter disappeared for a few hours. I sent her to the shops. Now, terwijl ik het lees, toe maak my maag sommer so draai. In die commotion. In, in the sense, at some stage, I just shut down. And I said, Lord, please, in the name of Jesus, just protect your children. Because what's happening around here is not in your world. And I was reading this message. She said, my daughter disappeared for a few hours. I sent her to the shops. Now, dit het my al klaar kwaad gemaakt. Right? 
it, you, can't, you can't in this day and age still send your daughter, your little girl, to the shops. Anyway, uh, when she came back, because she says they were looking for the child, and then at some stage the child came back. I thought, oh, thank God. However, blood was running down her legs, and yeah, she had been raped. Um, hmm. it, did it make all the commotion? Alles he saw. It didn't matter to me anymore. Because here was a little girl that was viciously violated, raped by an adult. A person that was supposed to help her. Then I realized, Lord, the demonic dissension, the, the, the demonic uh, infiltration is not just here. In this building. It has descended on the whole of South Africa. In fact, it has descended on the whole of Africa. Actually, you know what? It has descended on the whole world, the globe. It has been infiltrated by the Amalekites and the Midianites, the people that have come to kill, steal, and destroy. So when I go through the, the, the five C's with you, I need you to, at the back of your mind, just think about this fact. That in the midst of the, the, this whole scenario, I hope I can not see who is in the world. Liana Hendricks is here, Cherise is here, uh, Maggie Eskins, my cousin is here, Carl Norkia. Albert is hier so, alle jelle, alle jelle, dat ek net ordentlik groet is op. In the midst of this power struggle, this power, it's all, dat valg my. And then I see video clips of a mother, or a sister, or a friend, a wife, I'm not sure who this lady is, but there's a, a corpse lying in the street, it's just crazy. People standing there and this woman is screaming and I'm trying to figure out what is going on in her mind because her is so it is so deep it is so raw it is so desperate it is a a geskree van I think op die oomlik was daar seker van a out of body experience want jy kan nie in jou menselike lichaam nog wees en ervaar wat die vrou ervaar het nie, jylle. Want iemand, een geliefde van haar, le daar dood, geskiet. Die video, die persoon wat die video geneem het, en nog verder in gaan, to sy ander uh, uh, persoon wat ook geskiet is, langs een uh, 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 danger box wat ook al. En I'm thinking, ok, hmm. we have failed, these young people. We, as the adults of this country, we have failed these young people because why would in a community where children are supposed to be still friends, where young men were supposed to be working, they were supposed to be employed, they were supposed to have their own businesses, why do they have time to kill one another because of turf, because of territory, because of drug-related issues? Everybody... In that city of Joburg, Metropole, I don't care what party you are. I don't care what party we represent. We have failed those young people. Time for action. No more talking. Yeah, well, we have to talk here first to make you aware of what's happening. Because what type of action? We can't just action, action, what? Give us suggestions. What action? Huh? Give us suggestions. It's good. But we have actions. Uh, 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 we have plans for action. And it will not be illegal stuff. You understand what I'm saying? The, I was talking about the crime now. I don't have to tell you what, sort, what type of crime there is. You know. You, you are much aware 
of all the good morning, good morning, my favorite and only SG Jacques Talliard. Goedemorgen, my broer. Um, crime is all over. Crime is all over. Um, and it is so, it, it feels for me very strategic, very structured. Now, as a, as a doel, as a reader, waarom hier die landse regering, die, die, die sogenaamde president, en al sy kronies en al sy mense, there's a specific reason why they do not act as much as they should to protect the farmers. There's a specific reason why they really don't care about the violence in the Cape Flats. There's a reason why it's so easy for thugs to break into a police station and take weapons. There's a reason why adults or, 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 or senior citizens are being attacked in their homes where they're supposed to be safe. There's a reason why, let me read this for you. A total of 150 girls aged between 10 and 14 have given birth in the past five months in the Free State. In Mpumalanga, around 91,000 91, schoolgirls are pregnant, mostly around the age of 13 to 17. So that is most now statutory rape of, of all these things. It's, it's statutory rape. So it is also crime, but it is done under very different guises. Teachers raping to rape. If, 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 a, if a man takes a nine-year-old girl to the bush and rapes her, it's, it's, it's a crime. So now, I don't know how to do it, but I don't want to my thoughts full. So now, I am busy with the Teddy Bear Foundation and SAPS, etc. They're in the area where this little girl in not Pretoria in Johannesburg was raped. Because we need to find this person. We need to find this rapist. Because you know what? He will not stop. If he is not stopped, he will not stop on his own. So that's the type of... The crime has increased. If we... The action that we are taking right now is actually basically, basically on our knees and there's other people that are doing other stuff. It must be a collective of actions with other organizations that we go over or that we go into. When I came to the Constitution, I realized that the Constitution is flawed. The Constitution is flawed, people. The original constitution was good. It was a it was a constitution that was applicable and, and relevant then. And then the constitution was chopped and changed so many times. And each time the constitution was chopped and changed, it became more and more increasingly flawed. We as the UIM, yes. In principle, we are with the Constitution, but there's a lot of things that we would like to change. That we would like to be restored, because there's things that's left out and things that has been added that is not supposed to be in the Constitution. I'm not going to go into that because of time. But you know, you have seen how the Constitution has given a lot of these criminal Government, uh, government officials a gap to do whatever they want. And they are still doing it. And it's not steeds bezig om hierdie act, poppy act, all die acts, a act om toe te laat dat mense in jou uh, uh, perseel kom en doen net wat hulle wil. Wel, ons het ook a constitutional right to protect ourselves. Those type of things, das klomp acts, wat maak dat kriminele wegkom met moord. There's no scenarios where women, they are being sexually harassed at school, female teachers. And when they make a case against it, they are being treated like the villains. That's who feel 
female teachers that have, they, they are suffering from PTSD. And they now have to go to CCMA. They now have cases. They, it's not normal. And those same teachers are also exposed to children. To children that are ill-disciplined. To children that are just left. It's a crime as a parent. You are a criminal if you are not teaching your children, if you are not bringing up your children according to specific rules and regulations. If you steer your gemors, holding attitude, you send your child with a, with a rubbish attitude to school. And then teachers have to teach that child, and you did not instill principles in your child. You could not, he not grow up in and in with that many ways as I can school to steer. You as a parent, it is a crime if you don't bring up your child properly, if you don't teach your children uh, um, rules and responsibilities, rights. You let me tell your children about rights. No right, no gele for you, no one on a par right. Because you did not bring up your child right. Correctly. You didn't. And so teachers are now sitting with that. Can you imagine being a, a, a teacher where the Department of Education is not there to protect you? Your fellow um, teacher or colleague is harassing you, sexually harassing you. Plus you have to fight the child that has become violent against you. Something has got to give. Something is going. Ivers gaan die popo die ceiling tref en het gaan nie a mooi ding wees nie. So the, the, my, my take on the constitution is, yes, we will, we will protect the constitution, but I feel the constitution needs to be, ay, my constitution, hy moet bieke recht gemaakt word, wa? Ah, das, das, das groot fout. Groot, groot fout met hierdie constitution. Why, why is crime thriving under this constitution? Why? Because there's loopholes. They've created lots of, lots and lots of loopholes. Okay. Hmm. The capital still stands in the hands of the elitists. Let's be real. The capital is not states. And the hander, and the elitists. Plus, the deep state government. Now, there's a few people that really, really try to convince me that my brother is part of the deep state. If he part, if he, if he was part of the deep state, here then who comes to call on us financially? So, ah. Huh? Because the deep state parties, they are funded phenomenally, phenomenally. They've got everything. They move everywhere. They destroy wherever they go. The money that we as the, the majority or the masses collect goes into a kitty. The hands of the elitists are also in that kitty as well as this corrupt government. Pansef. Ha ha! I get a new name gekry. Ja, ja, dit is toe, toe nou nie Pansef nie tans. Is nou toe Pansef. Ja. Maar in elk geval, selfs die vriendskap, even that partnership, is going to crumble. Because it's, it's partnerships that is built on What's in it for me? And when there's nothing in it for them anymore, the cookie is going to crumble. But for the sake of the people, I my prayer is just that whatever their what call or and so on, it must benefit the people. But I know it doesn't. I know it's about them. So, in the two weeks that I was there in council, shame, um, the DA councillors, MMC, 
of housing, uh, went to visit my colleagues, the UIM colleagues in Snake Park, and they were busy with talks to get electricity and water, because those people have been living without electricity and water for the past 30 years. So the talks were still on. <laughs> and then, whoops, switch off government. Suddenly, it's not the DA anymore. Now it is the ANC. But guess what? Ek gaan op die coalitie sit, so so draw aan a wall kom bers, hulle sal flippen elektriciteit by die plek gaan insit, en onse mense gaan help. I will, I will, ek gaan die councillors wat knaand, irriterend, die heel tijd vir hulle gaan vraag, wanne gaan julle, gaan julle na die mense toe? Wanne sit julle elektriciteit in? Wanne sit julle water in? I will keep them accountable in die ATM councillor wat ook daar kamakastig is, blijf vir jare daar so, hy het niks gedoen vir hierdie mense nie. Nog vir my wil kom roep om te kom gesel, gesels oor wat? Jy weet julle wat? Ek besef nou eers die mense die heel tyd probeer om my, hy voetig, dis die tweede keer wat het gebeur met my, dat, dat mense, a plan het met my, my ek is so gefokus, ek klik nie eens nie, shame, dit is verlede jaar, december, die 14e ook met my gebeur, dat, dat was mense wat een complot, wat, wat bezig is met iets, en ek is eindelijk pivotal in hierdie hele scenario, maar ek weet ons al nie daarvan nie, en, uh, kan die, back at the ranch, nou gaan ek, mos maar nou, nog steeds my richting, waarin ek beweeg het, en, uh, ek gaan nie saam met hulle nie, want ek, Ek verstaan nie wat gaan eindelijk aan nie. So dit is wat ook vrede vir my gebeur het. Hierdie twee kansel is van twee verskillende partije. Een van ATM en weet jy wat sê ander partij nie. Bly my roep, vir my my gesels. Wat wil jylle gesels van my? Vir die gesels nie. Ek is nie om tjommies te maak nie. Dus het een van die partije wat saam met die ANC gestem het. Ek sê later die foto's vir jy toch. Maar nie te veel. Ek Chop and change nie. Hier is in Brussel al vreeslik met kracht en water. Kom, ek sê vir julle iets omtrend kracht en water. Kracht en water is it's a pivotal resource that we as human beings we need it. We cannot live without it. And that is, those are the two things that is being withheld from us not just in South Africa. As I told you in the beginning, all of this that's happening, it's globally. It's global. Ek het gesien daar in India, of in ander plek was daar, was die kracht afgesit vir een hele paar daar, but all the war, all the power, the whole country was in darkness. So guys, guys, be very vigilant, just be aware that this, what's happening in South Africa is not just South Africa, it's happening globally. Die water resources, Food, electricity, finances, die banke, begin al, they are acting up, dan hoor jy hierdie bank is van lijn af, dan hoor jy hier so kan jy nie met geld werk nie, it's the new world order, it's what is happening now is also written in the bible. So, laat ek nie myself voorspring nie, gaan nou vir julle sê wat is die conclusion munt aan die einde van hierdie geselsiekie. Yeah, I actually mentioned it before. Corruption. Corruption has taken the form of deals, tenders, underhanded coalitions, etc. etc. Um, when a person can tell you already what is going to happen in this city and in that city, it means the person is planning what is going to happen in this city and in that city. So this corrupt people, they are sitting and scheming, terwyl ek en jy lekker slaap en soan, they are sitting and scheming and planning how they can get power back and continue to steal. And that is why we can't really afford to just be doozy daisy and all relaxed en soan. Ons moet ook oorgaan tot die punt waar ons Ja, en eindelijk het ons wel klaar begin. The fact that the UIM was started. Let me haal het at you with this is concerned. 
the UIM started last year. Actually, maybe two years ago. I can't even tell you. And it started because a man who could have just loved his life because he was doing quite good. You know, he's a businessman. His businesses did good. He made a a few rands. Um, but then he saw, hey, maar my land is mis bezig om te verkrimmel. Ek moet iets doen nie omtrend. So you see, man alone, you can't do much. You have to start something. And he started a movement. United Independent Movement. But then, he realized that a movement gaan nie aan government kan kom nie. Part, the, 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 the system is built like that. For those who think that you can still go into parliament and in government as an individual, uh-uh, but not for you, you have a party yet. So that we realized last year already. So a party was started and boom. What are the chances of that party having three seats in three very, very important provinces? So for the answer, but... Toak post die so. Van, ja, jy praat te veel. Waar, waar was jy gewees? Ek het gelees gister. Waar was jy gewees? Toe, toe jy jou mense moes gejap het. Oeh, oeh, oe, asjeblief. Hou net op my reis rond. Ne? Waar was jy? Jy waar die vraag vraag. Waar die hel was jy gewees? Hoe kom het jy nie iets omtrend het gedoen? So hou op om van deelde weer rabbies te vraag. Van, waar was jy? Waar was jy? Wat hy toak, tak. Right? Neel de beer het iets gedoen. Hy is nou nog bezig om iets te doen. En saam doen ons baie. Together we will conquer this. But you know what? We will not be doing it by being corrupt. We will not be doing it by underhanded. Because believe me, we are being approached. Soos ek jou nou, die, nou, nee, nou net gesê het, hulle wil praat met jou. Straight. Even if it means, even if it means that we stand alone as a party, we will not align ourselves with any communistic, any demonic, any underhanded, any both. We will not. Let us then be unpopular. Let us then be known as the ones that didn't want to. Want hulle lach jou uit. Ek het gesê daar in die kaas. Ek lyk nou soos die stupid, want ek het nie saam met hulle gewild nie. In my kop, wees ek hulle allemaal a paar vingers. Jy onderstel waar hom sê. So, van volgende, wanneer ons weer oopmaak, we've got another thing coming. Hulle gaan so spuit, hulle gaan later sê nou, let this council hem as lief, we are sick and tired of it. Ek sal haar blij, gaan op hulle nerves werk. We can only defeat, you can only defeat corruption, capital, defend the constitution, or correct the constitution, and crime. We can only do it on our knees. Yes, works. We have to do the works as well. But 90% of the battle, the war that we are going to win is going to be on our knees. 10% is the action, the signing up for the party. Join the party. The uh, 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 keyboard warriors, join the party. Go on our website www.uimsa.org Go to that link where you can uh, 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 join and so on. Invite us. Tell us. Listen, we've got a hall of 10 people. Please come talk to us about the UIM. Bring uh, registration forms. We register you. Voila. You as a member then, because as you're a member, as you sit, as you're, as you're a Kerk membership for you, net elke sondag keer te kom en kom niks doen, nie, 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 as jy jou member is, dan begin jy ook te werk, al vinger uit, begin ander mense te sê, van die UIM, you understand what I'm saying, it is going to take everyone that is moaning and groaning, ja, it's fine, everyone that is moaning and groaning, you do something about it, jy, do not, Vraak deel van die mense wat iets wil doen daar omtree. I see us as being the alternative to all 
the other corrupt people. We will be the party that people go, hey, this was, that's not good. Mm -mm. I can't go with this one. Uh, no, this, mm, nah, pan, nah, uh, uh, pan safe, no, can't. You are in. On this dieselfde, who ons was verlede jaar, ons is nog steeds still on the same track. Still depend, depending on God. The war zone is not on this earth, guys. We just see the manifestation of the war here. We see it amongst ourselves. I asked myself while that circus was on. Even external body came in there. If a group of gunmen from wherever, from hell, came into that building, started shooting, what would those people have done? Would they have pushed the other party members in front of the guns? Or would they all have ran for protection? You understand? Eén dag staan ons allemaal voor een oop graf. En die graf gaan nie het teken het van die partij waarin jy was nie. However, we need structure, we need a, a specific organization, and in this case it is the United Independent Movement, to do the movement. There's free membership for pensioners, free membership for youth, the two very important people we've got uh, 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 the afdeling, but the do not met afgetreden uh, uh, veteranen, Eugenius and Beheer daarvan. Uh, we've got a lot of honor, we've got a lot of Afrikaans and Engels. We have a lot of uh, departments that is addressing different things. There's something on my heart concerning the women, because I know we are a strong bunch. Because last week, I really wanted a whole lot of women. To walk in the streets with me, with a type of, with a message to say we are looking for a rapist. We are looking for this bastard who took a nine-year-old. As we so 30 vrouwen saam was, hey, dan, dan was ons, dan was ons skoppe deur gewees, want ons gesoek in die strate. So I need warriors, I need women that are sick and tired of the rubbish that is going on. And I get a mama as a baie sterk mens, okay? If the I read a story of the ants in a bottle. Roy, Roy Mere and Swart Mere. Leave a free sum at Makar. But as I bottle has cut for the Bachilla Makar to bite in the Fernita. If the hand shakes the bottle with the ants, let see to it that we are on the outside of the bottle. We should never be part. Of the ants inside. We will look weird. We will not be seen as normal because our our principles are different. Our principles are based on God. Irrespective of your religion. In our party we have Islamic brothers and sisters, Hindu brothers and sisters, Jewish brothers and sisters, and luckily, the, the basis of the party, I'm going to say it again, we are not a Christian party, but I am a Christian. Neil de Beer is a Christian. Most people in the party are Christians. But we are so open and accommodative of all, of all parties. We will never call this a Christian party. It is a God-based party. Now let us, as God people, go on our knees. And pray for our people, for protection, for provision. The Israelites had one guy called um, Israel. Uh, Joseph, sorry. Provided for his brothers and sisters in the midst of this famine. Now in the midst of all of this great that is happening here. We pray for God's favor over our lives. We pray for God's favor over the lives of our young people, the senior citizens, the children. And we pray that the God will remove the Amalekites and the Midianites who have come to kill, steal, and destroy. 
This is not over by a long shot. Ons het nog een lang pad om te gaan. Moe nie moet opgee nie. Moe nie desperaat raak nie. Because desperate people do desperate stuff. And it all, it gets all messed up. So help us grow. Help us fight. Don't sit on the fence. And criticize us. That's trying to do something. I've been asking God. Lord give me a plan. Ask God the same thing. Father give us a plan. There is a plan. Intact. All we need to do is step into that plan. And stay on the right track. I can never align myself with someone who has got a split tongue. Never. As you two tongue it, I can spank for you. Eh, play weg. Let me grow. I can it. So, spirit of discernment as well. We need to know who we have to align ourselves with. If if it doesn't feel, yes, I can tell you, was in a par vergaderings geweest, ne? Waar ik en Neil, ik weet, samengezet het. And I would not be talking in that meeting because I'm observing and I have to pray. But when Neil opens up his mouth, and then I, then that feel it for me so good. Want what I say is what I feel. You understand? Um, when he just says no, no, thank you. And the 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 principles of 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 the Bible, he actually speaks it out and says, you know what? Um, we are a party in God. No, I don't think other party leaders actually say this besides obviously the ACDP. But you would say we are a party in God. We are a party in Christ and we will not align ourselves with any organization or any person that is not aligned according to the word of God. I'll stand on some lean means. Praat nou van, as ek sê, ons, praat ons van jylle in kles. Even if we stand alone, we stand in God. Twee tonge is a slang, ja nie, twee tonge is a skanny, skanny, skanny. So, kom ons bid saam. Ja, 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 kom ons bid saam. Heere, baie dankie, vir hierdie wonderlijke voorheid wat ons het, om net in een naam te kan vergader. Net om te sê dankie vir die feit dat ons is waar ons is, en dat ons een verskil kan maak in ons medemense sy levens. En ek bid, Vader, dat jy vir ons een geest van onderscheiding sal gee, dat jy vir ons een geest van samenhoorigheid sal gee. En liefde, laat jy liefde sê vier, wat jy liefde nooit weggaan van ons af nie. En respect, en dat ons saam dier hierdie strijd sal gaan, en dat ons daar aan die ander kant sal uitkom, meer as oorwinnaars. Amen. I just realized now, I prayed in Afrikaans, sorry, ek praat Afrikaans met die heren, so, ja, but you understood, but it's fine, he understood, so, God bless you all, nothing illegal, yes, amen, amen, thank you so much for watching, I hope this was encouraging to you. Please spread the word. Um, let us stay humble. Let us stay in God. And never forget. Together we will. In the mighty, mighty name of Jesus. Hallelujah.